Speed went this weekend? Uh, I think it was okay. Um, we're training hard and it's just a step in the process, so I think it was okay. You, got, you say you're training hard, but Georgia has just been swimming really well in season at all these meets. Yeah. Um, what is that like to see that as a teammate? It's really cool. I mean, I get to watch them every day train, and um, we know that each other's capable of doing these amazing things, so it's it's really cool just to be a part of that. Where do those swims come from when you're tired like that? Um, just we prepare for them, and um, mental, I guess. <laughs> I guess. Are you going to be doing the 400, 800 free at um, Nationals this summer? Um, I honestly have no idea. Um, I have no clue what I'm going to swim. Um, yeah, I really don't. I'm just trying different things out, seeing what happens. So. How do you think? How do you uh, feel that two fly went with Kelsey? Uh, it was good. Um, Kelsey and I love swimming next to one another. Um, we push each other. Um, it hurt a lot more than the one this morning. Two flies feel different every single time I swim them, I swear. Um, but I love racing next to Kelsey. Love it, love it, love it. How would you, uh, were you a little disappointed that Ella and Katie Draybot scratched for finals? Yeah, I would have loved to race them. They're having such a good meet. Stanford's doing amazing. Um, and I like, I, I saw Katie's splits and she went out fast. And that's kind of what I need because I kind of back off on the front. Um, and I like having people to kind of push me on the front half. Um, but next time. They'll be a next time. When you saw how well they did at NCAAs, did that kind of light a fire under you at all? or just? Yeah, it was like really cool to... I, I was in their shoes and um, the momentum kind of keeps going through the year um, when she won a national championship um, with a team and kind of just like keeps going through the season. So it's really cool for them and I know they're going to be swimming really fast this summer. Are you excited to get back to work after this? I am, I am. Um, I, I have been under the weather for about a week now, so I might need to take a little um, breather just to get this um, under control. Um, but yeah, always excited. I love training. Yeah. Yeah. What's been going on with the sickness? Um, so I got my tonsils out and I had surgery up here in August um, and I was getting sick all the time with like ulcers in the back of my throat, tonsillitis and stuff and strep. Um, and uh, I haven't gotten sick very much this year, but this is the third time, or second or third time this has happened this year. I just have like ulcers down my throat and um, just like swollen up and down. But it, hopefully it will go away. I think it's a virus and literally you can't do anything for it. So I just gotta wait it out. <laughs> How's the married life? It's good. Um, it's nothing really has changed. I say that all the time. What's new? What's yeah. different? Um, it's really the same. Um, we have three animals now. Oh. Um, two cats and a dog. We love our animals. Um, so, yeah, our little family is growing. Any more on the way? No. <laughs> <laughs> um, I've, I've learned that a dog is way different than the cats. We got two cats and then a dog, and a dog is literally like a child. It's My parents forewarned us that the dog was worse than her two kids that she had and so I'm basically prepared for whenever I want to have kids down the road I I believe because the dog was really hard. Is it a bigger dog or a smaller dog? Or? It's a lab yeah and we got her when she was a little puppy. It's a lot of work a lot of work. All right thanks Haley. Yep thank